Hey y'all, Irix guy here. Now I have encountered a, uh, actually an unexpected issue the first time I've encountered it with the Phantom 3 and I wanted to bring this to the attention of everyone. Now, I'm not sharing this to try to frighten people and say, ooh, the Phantom is no good. No, the Phantom is awesome and the Phantom 3 is without a doubt my favorite drone on the market today. Uh, but what I encountered earlier, and if you watch uh, my previous video, very lengthy video where I was testing the, uh, the horizon stability issue, because I did encounter an issue with that also due to uh, extreme wind speed over the ocean. But that was related to the wind speed. As, as you saw in my previous video, if you've watched it, everything was perfectly aligned with the horizon, no problems there. But there's a bias issue, B-I-A-S. So what happened when I tried to start my, uh, when I tried to start my Phantom 3, it said B-I-A-S and it had a bunch of other stuff, bias, blah, 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 blah please contact DJI support or something along those lines. Now I know I'm not gonna contact support because number one, I don't have the patience and number two, I wanna fix it myself. So what I did, just to summarize, in case you don't wanna watch my, my other extended duration video where the error actually occurred in real time, first time I had encountered that error, uh, what I did to fix it, I powered off the Phantom 3, I removed the battery from the Phantom 3, kept it out for, I don't know, 20 seconds, 30 seconds or so, I powered off my iPhone 6 Plus, I powered off my Phantom controller, and just let all of that stay off for a little bit. Uh, then I powered everything back up, and sure enough, it worked fine. Uh, but it was a weird issue, because what would happen if I tried to start the engines, and I'm not gonna do it right now because the Phantom's powered on, by pulling both the sticks down, it would give me the BIAS error. And then also, if I tried to do the in-app in the DJI Pilot app, where you do the, uh, excuse me, the auto takeoff, it would, it would populate the same error, the BIAS, blah, 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 contact DJI support error. Uh, so if you've seen that one, you know, be sure to try those steps that I just suggested. Maybe it'll fix you too. Uh, if it doesn't, uh, you may want to make sure you've got the most current firmware, uh, not just on your Phantom 3, but also on your Phantom 3 controller, because that's a, that's a common mistake that I've seen a lot of people make, is that, and now keep in mind, every firmware update is not Phantom 3 and controller. Some of them only update the Phantom 3. Uh, but so far, I think I've only seen one firmware that was Phantom 3 only. Uh, but it, you know, it won't hurt. You know, put it in. Follow the procedure for your uh, for your controller also, because if it if it doesn't need updating, it it shouldn't update it. So, uh, just a few quick tips. Be sure to subscribe if you haven't already. YouTube.com forward slash Irix guy and uh, forward slash Irix guy. And uh, check out all my drone tutorial videos. I got quite a few on 400orbelow.com. You can also go to droneevangelist.com and I'll feature it all there. And if you don't see what you're looking for, shoot me a message. Probably the best way to get me is my website or a Facebook fan page, facebook.com forward slash irix guy. And I'll see if I can whip up a video uh, to better address your, uh, your questions. I appreciate your viewership and y'all have a good day.